Hey guys, it's Laura here. So today I went shopping. Um, and so I'm actually doing a haul. I have three in total that are going to be going up, so be prepared for that. But first, I'm going to do my Target haul because that is that is where I went slightly overboard. I did a little bit of damage today. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead, I'm going to flip the camera around, and I'll show you guys what I got. Okay, so sorry if you guys hear any noise in the background. I have my sister over. She's helping to get stuff passed out. So, okay, we're obviously getting very close to Easter, so you're going to notice almost all of what I got is Easter-oriented. Okay, so first we have the baskets. All of the stuff, like I said, is from Target. Okay, so first I have this little Easter basket, and it's really cute. They're little metallic gold and it's like eggs or little polka dots and that is for my daughter and then this one is for my son and it has the same metallic -y paint except this one is obviously Easter eggs so they're really cute it's little flag decals I don't know I just thought it was cute so and then to go along with the Easter baskets they each have a thing of grass to go in their to go in their baskets. So next, um, okay, so next, sorry about my foot over there. Um, next we got these uh, spring string, it's like silly string. So my daughter has the purple one and my son has the blue. I figured that would be fun for them to play with. And then, sorry, I'm trying not to show all that over there. So the next, they each have a golden Easter egg. So I saw these really cute cups. My kids are definitely older. They don't really need sippy cups, but these, I don't think that they really are sippy cups. It's like a little straw cup. I mean, I don't know, maybe it is a sippy cup and it's totally inappropriate for older kids, but they're cute. So that's the one I got for my son. And then... This is the one for my daughter. They're just, they're so cute. Like the little, they're soft. I don't know. I thought it was adorable. Okay, so next, obviously, to go along with Easter, we have Easter egg coloring kits. So my kids, they enjoy doing this, and I don't know, I just thought it's a nice little variety. So, and then to go along with that, I got the little Easter egg coloring cups. So I got two of them and I realized that they have this little uh, crayon so you can put designs on the eggs and they also come with colors. So I'm not sure how we're gonna do that. And then, and then I also got this thing of vinegar to help bring out the color of that. So give me just a second to get this moved away and I'll be with right back with what's next okay and so next as you can see I have candy I feel like I may have gone slightly overboard on this like I said I did some damage at Target so I got the kids each a little hollow Easter Bunny what I think I'm gonna do is I think I'm actually gonna take these out of the little box since it's individually wrapped anyways that way I don't have this huge box taking up room in their baskets so let me set those off to the side now, they do have cousins, so some of this stuff, like this in particular, they're only going to get a couple of these in their basket, and then the rest is going to be put into eggs to be stuffed for the Easter egg hunt. So they're going to have, like I said, a couple of these for in their basket, but most of them is, it's going to be put away for later. So next, I have these two little things of jelly beans. Um, both of my kids like Frozen, but my son is he really loves Olaf so I got the Elsa for my daughter and then obviously my son will be getting the Olaf so next I saw these now usually every year for Christmas they get the little candy cane um, little candy things so I thought that these with the little Easter bunnies were really just too cute to pass up so I got them each one of these I want to say that these are a like two dollars or something like that each but I mean they're really cute and this amount of candy will last them 
quite a while. So when they're little M&Ms, I'm trying to see if you can... Some of them have like little Easter eggs on them. So it's really cute. So next, obviously, I think I got these every year as a kid. But the little Reese's Pieces. Um, yeah, the little Reese's Pieces. Little carrot looking things. I don't know. I just thought they were cute. So I grabbed those. And those were only a dollar each. So also on the a dollar each was these little peeps on a stick. So I don't particularly like peeps, but my kids like them, so I figured I would go ahead and get this for them, and they're going to be really excited to see these in their basket. So next, I got them a couple of these, what are they? Cadbury Caramel Eggs. My kids love these, but I didn't want to get a whole bag because really they don't need a bunch of candy, I mean, and they've already got a lot, so... I didn't need a whole bunch of extra candy. So they each have one. So there's going to be one of these in each of their baskets. And these, I think, are actually going to go inside of the golden eggs. So along with uh, some other stuff, which I will show you in a second. So we'll go ahead and stick those in there for now. So and then last but not least, we have some of these... Like we have, there's one for M&M's, one for Skittles, and then one that is Starburst. So there's one of each. And so that's what they're, that's what they're going to get. They're each going to get one of each in their basket. And then they have a couple of eggs in their baskets. All right. So that is it for the candy. It's, it's a lot. <laughs> All right. Be right back with the rest of our stuff. Okay. And so here... Now this is something that I'm not sure if it's going to be included in their Easter basket or not because they've been asking for these for a while. But their cousins play with Pokemon cards and every time they go over there they play the cards but their cousins don't necessarily share very well all the time. So I got them these. So they each have three packs of, of cards and then a little... A little deck holder so this oh and looks like they each come with a and there's some cards or something in there so I'm actually going to be taking the Pokemon cards out of this little box and I'm gonna leave them in the little packaging so that the kids can open the packaging but I'll be right back once I've gotten them all sorted in um, and I'm not sure what we're gonna do with these little coin things because I'm pretty sure my kids are just gonna lose those so give me just one second and I will be right back. Okay, so I'm back. We've opened them all up. I did decide to go ahead and actually open up the cards just because my kids are pretty young. I didn't want them to accidentally rip it. But there's these things, which they can... That one came from my box. That one came from your box. Okay, mm -hmm. we don't want to show the code. Um, so, but there's codes on these. And I'm not sure what, the, what those are for, but that'll be fun. And then... Each of the three packs of cards that they had came with these little these little coins. So we're just gonna stick those in the box. And then they each have a box. So like I said, I'm not sure if I'm gonna give them give these to them now or if I want to give it to them for Easter. I'm not 100 percent sure yet, but they've been asking for Pokemon cards. And now they have them. Okay. So I will be right back with the next items. Alright, now these are kind of like little blind bags. These are Shopkins. I went ahead and I got her three of them. My daughter loves Shopkins. Um, she actually has some puzzles of Shopkins. So these are really cute. So it has one fashion tag, one sticker, and one Shopkin. So she's really going to enjoy opening this up and finding out what she has. Now they didn't really have any little blind bags that I could find for little boys. So what I got for him was just these little Marvel superhero adventures. He will love all of these. So he has a Hulk, an Iron Man, and a Spider-Man. 
All right, and now really quickly, just to go ahead and finish off this haul, they each got a stuffed animal. So my son got a blue one, my daughter got an orange one. They both got these little eggs that have 40 tattoos. Hers is Disney's Frozen, and his is Marvel. Then I got them each some bubbles, some color bubbles, which are for outside only because they do stain if it gets on clothes or furniture. So it says that it rubs off of skin pretty easily, but I don't know how much I believe that. So then my kids love glow bracelets. So this thing has 40 in a... All right, sorry about that. <laughs> I had a phone call come in. So this is, like I said, it's 40 bracelets. Um, and what we're going to do is the kids are each going to get a few of these in their baskets and then the rest are probably going to go to our cousins. That way they have some as well. So next, my kids love yo-yos. They, um, they're pretty good with them, but you know, after a while they do break and theirs that they got last year broke recently. So I went ahead and I got them some new yo-yos. So, and then as kind of like a special um, thing, my son got this Baymax. It says that it hatches, um, so I'm not sure what that is or how that's supposed to work exactly, but we'll get it figured out, and I'm pretty sure he's going to love that. So, and then for my daughter, um, I am actually just seeing now that she does have one more item than him, so... Um, one of these may wind up going back. I'm not sure yet which. I probably will take this back. She doesn't really need it. Um, because she has lip balm. So, but this is a Hello Kitty little nail set. So it obviously has the little applique nails and then little gems and stuff for her to put on. Yeah, see, and this actually comes with lip balm. Or includes a lip balm case. So, I don't know. We'll see. Um, this right here may wind up going back so that they're even. Um, I don't know. So I just, I saw this. It was cute. My daughter's always asking to paint her nails. So I just thought that she would really like this. Um, oh yeah. See, it's lip and nail set. So I'm pretty sure that there's some lip gloss in here. So in the next to go on their little baskets is my daughter has a little M and my son has somewhere a little, a little C. So... Oh, and real quick. Okay, so and then my kids also got Legos, and they're really big into Legos. So we got this. She got the little Disney princess one, and it has, you know, a bunch of stuff in there. And then my son got some Lego City, which it looks like the set is to build a car. <coughs> Sorry about that. Okay, so that is it for the kids as far as the haul goes. So the only other thing that I got is I got this coloring book for me, which was 30% off. So it came with double-ended colored pencils, and then it's just, you know, a bunch of things to color. So <laughs> we'll see how that goes. And then my sister was with me, and she begged for this. So it was cute. I went ahead and I got it. Okay, guys, so that was my Target haul. Like I said, I think I went just a tad overboard this year, but, you know, my husband's always done this, and I didn't realize how tempting it is to basically buy the entire store. So, I'm going to go ahead and end this video here. I have a couple others to film, so you guys will have regular videos this week. All right, bye.